Hey guys, what's up? I'm here at Camp 5 in Wanutama, Asia's biggest climbing gym, okay? And we're gonna head on inside to do some crazy climbing and falling and all that cool stuff. Let's go! Vandal, welcome to Camp 5. Hey Jeremy, how's it going? Alright, good, very good. So, right, first so time here, right? Yes, first right. time. Cool. What do I do? What do you need? Well, we're gonna get you signed up as a member, so I'll run you through that process. Okay. Once we've done that, you're good to go. Great. Yeah? Here we are, Asia's largest indoor climbing gym. Right, so we're just starting up, we're gonna go through this bit, and then eventually you're gonna see how big this really gets. All right, right. so Let's start on over here. Okay. We've got the auto wall. Now this wall is particularly unique because it's got these devices. And what's unique about these devices is you can climb, as you can see right here, you can climb on your own. Mm -hmm. So you don't need a climbing buddy. So okay. your buddy's stuck in traffic, which is, it happens in KL. Uh, you can do a bit of warm up. Uh, you can come in on a lunch break. Yeah, it was my first time at Camp 5 and uh, to be honest, uh, I was a bit intimidated at first because uh, the last time I went climbing was ages ago, like back in Canada. In Camp 5, we've got this, uh, we've got our own cafe. When we work out, we need to eat, right? We need yeah. to refuel. So we focus on making a menu which is designed for people who are very active in their lives. So lots of nutrients, uh, organic where we can make it. Mm -hmm. Not everything is 100% organic, I gotta admit that but we try where we can. It's pretty cool. Um, we ate at the cafe, had a nice burger. I recommend the burgers to all of you guys out there who are planning a trip to Camp 5. Now this is where it gets pretty exciting. Now I've got to admit to you, we only opened an hour ago. So we're in the quiet time of the day. So there's not okay. a lot of people. Yep. Uh, it's a weekday, our crowd rocks in around about 7 o'clock, so most of our members are at work right now as we speak, so about 7 o'clock they'll come in, you'll see this place start to pack out. Obviously on weekends, it gets really packed. So when I got to Camp 5, um, my first step was to uh, get, get a bit of knowledge and training. So Vandal, I've invited one of Camp 5's coaches okay. to give it, not, not that I couldn't teacher but these guys they do it that's their job yeah the friendly Diane he helped me out he showed me different techniques to do on a boulder wall the cross and how not to use your arms so much it's more about your legs to lift yourself up rather than pulling yourself up so I learned a lot from him um, definitely you know try out one of the trainers at Camp 5 they've got a lot of knowledge they're gonna save you a lot of aching arms and all the rest of it so definitely worth it. Shout out to Diane. Yo, climbing is fun. You guys, if you haven't tried it, you need to try it out. After getting the, the first little uh, nerves out of the way on the, uh, on the boulder wall, um, I just do what comes naturally. <laughs> So I tried this thing called the quick jump. Um, it's a 12 meter drop from the top of the t uh, highest climbing wall. Nothing to worry about. Nope. So here we are at camp five. This is the quick jump. And uh, I'm gonna give it a go. Are you ready? Okay. <laughs> you know, I was a bit nerve wracking at first because I've never really done, you know, bungee jumping or anything like that. Um, I've done cliff diving into water, uh, but this was something totally different and <clears throat> I think the experience was like At first I'm like stepping out onto the edge and then I was like, okay, you know what forget it Let me just go for it. I'm all strapped in and everything and to think about it now I, sh I probably should have fell backwards because when I fell forwards the strap was here and it went and hit my shoulder and then as I fell into it, I suddenly got flung back and I had to grab the, uh, grab the harness. Next time if I try it, I'm going to fall backwards. So fall backwards, it's more fun. I made it. I made it guys. It feels exhilarating. At first I was like... <sighs> so Camp 5 is in uh, Wanitama. 
and uh, it's up on the parking lot and uh, where the parking lot part of the parking lot is they they were able to build the facility there I had an amazing time it was it was incredible I'm looking forward to going back and uh, this time I want to try things that are a little bit more difficult to uh, test my skill level all right here we are we've survived the quick jump and the wall and it's been crazy right here at Camp 5 and thanks so much to Jeremy Feet, director of You're Camp welcome. 5. You're welcome. Thanks How was so it? much. It was amazing. Exhilarating. Well, you realize and, you, you, uh, you only climbed one route. I know. So yeah, we, we got you another, set me up twice. We got There's so much more to go. Got another 400 waiting for you. This is Vandal signing off for the closer, InfoRadio.com. Check us out every Thursday, 8 to 9 p.m.